Hey guys, what is going on? It is Obadiah, and today we are back on Scorched Earth playing some Ark. Um, and oh my gosh, there is so much new stuff going on. Uh, first of all, check out the end slate I have going on. Hopefully it should go up on this video. I'm trying to make uh, things just a little better, a little more professional, trying to learn how to do things uh, in better and new ways. And so hopefully go ahead and check it out and tell me what you think in the comments below. Um... Also, I just launched a Patreon page. If you don't know what that is, that is where there is a type of crowdfunding support uh, for people who are trying to do what I'm trying to do, make videos and whatnot and have a good time. Um, so go check it out. It's patreon.com slash Obadiah X. Uh, just like all my other stuff is Obadiah X. Really easy to find me on pretty much anything. So today, uh, I want us to do a little bit of taming, you know? Uh, so I want to tame up some more Manti because pff, they're super awesome and also because I want to get their eggs so I can tame some more rock golems because you know what they're super awesome but taming them takes forever even with our rates which I am not a fan of uh, and I want to tame up some Jerboas because I always 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 seem short on Jerboas <laughs> they always die and I lose my so I just want a plethora around so what do we need to make some boomerangs to knock these suckers out. Wood, sand, and fiber? Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and get some of these things crafted up. Oh, there was some fiber. This wood, and then we got a little bit of wood in here, I think. Nope, okay, I should've just grabbed the wood when I saw it. Okay, let's get a little bit of wood. And make some boomerangs. Let's just make like, man, no, one, two, three, four, five of them. Cool, I'm gonna let these craft up, and I'm gonna go find some stuff for us to tame, and I'll bring y'all back. Alright, we have found our first Jerboa victim. And let me tell you, these suckers, not as, uh, not as easy to find as you might think. <laughs> I mean, they're really not. And these guys should tame up using the plant species X seeds, are kind of like their kibble. I remember, I mean, I remember seeing them, like, every two feet, like, there was just, like, Jerboa City everywhere. And now it took me it took me a few minutes to find one, a little more than I would like. And I'm not a big fan, because there's only one here, so I can't even tame two or three at once. I need to find like a Jerboa clan, a Jerboa family. Uh, and then tame the whole family and bring them home, you know? It's the right thing to do. You can't just leave little Jerboa babies without family. All right, we got ourselves Jerboa number one. Hey, bud. On the shoulder. Oh, yeah. All right, let's see if we can find Jerboa number two. We can carry, we can bring home two at once because uh, we can carry one on our shoulder and then have our bird pick one up. I decided to bring out the RG uh, simply because navigating on the wyverns is out of hand. It's like almost impossible to use. And as much as the wyverns are super cool, uh, it makes me miss Quetzals a lot. <laughs> but these guys, Argents are the easiest to fly around and grab stuff with, and you know, you just find all the, all the stuff we need and have no problems, even though they're a little bit slower. Um, where is, if there's like some area that's like, Super Jerboa Paradise or something? Can y'all let me know in the comments below so next time I need to get myself some Jerboas I don't have to fly around like this looking for them. Alright, once I kill these sabers, um, there were two Jerboas. There we go. There were two of them right here. Okay, there's one. Oh, there's two. Okay, and where there's two, there may be twelve. I'm pretty sure that's what the old classic Jerboa saying goes. Where there's two, there's twelve. So it's another male, which is not ideal. If we're gonna grab a second one, I'd rather get a female so we, oh, there we go. So we can try to breed them. What? Is this Jerboa immune? There we go. Uh, give him some plant species Y seeds. And where's the other one? I could tame the other one right now. The problem is I can only carry two back, but I mean, I'm gonna, because it doesn't really cost anything. And worst case scenario, he'll just hang out here and one day we'll find him and have a great reunited adventure and everything will be amazing and wonderful again and it'll be awesome. Uh, or he'll die in like five seconds because I'm probably just going to leave him here. Alright, here we go. Jerboa! Uh, let's put that away. Oop, put that away. And let's go. We got Jerboa on the shoulder. Alright, come here, bud. Oh, come here, little Jerboa. Uh, gotcha. Now, I'm going to say stay here. Where are we? We are at like 42.56. And he's going to chill there for a moment. I'm going to take these guys back to base. Alright, we are coming 
pretty close, I think, to where we left that Jerboa. Let's hope he's still here. Wouldn't that be amazing if we could find him and it was just awesomeness? Uh, where was it? Okay, so we came up this way. Does seem right? Yeah, it seems right. Oh, there he is! Oh, Jerboa, buddy! All right, now we gotta find another one. We took the other two back. That gives us three. And that is not nearly enough. That's rock elemental. What level are you? Oh, doesn't matter. Just get out of the way, because I want you to kill our Jerboa. Now what level are you? 28. No good. If we see like 120 or something, everything else is stopping, because we're going to get it. Uh, but we can't. We don't even have any kibble, and it's, it's going to be crappy level. Okay. Where are all my Jerboas? I think they're a little more prevalent over by Green Tower, I think. Don't quote me on that, but I feel like they're more of a drier desert type animal. Uh, which may be completely wrong. But that being the case, I should see them over here more. But so far, my theory has proven incorrect. Because the drier it gets, the less Jerboa I'm seeing. Alright, there are at least two more Jerboas here. Oh, we got another female, which is exactly what I want. Let's give you some seeds, and then, what are you, be another female? Oh, okay, another male, I mean, we'll take it. What was that, what was that, what was that, what is that, what is that, oh, okay, no! No, 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 no. You're gonna kill, get out of here. Ooh, this one's all red looking, he is cool. What level are you, bud? 12. You are level, that's what we call level garbage. All right, let's lead him away, let him go back to his rock form. Oh my gosh. Diagro, bud. I'm way up here, you can't hit me up here. Just Diagro. Well, I guess we'll look around for see if there's any more Jamboas on the floor. There we go, all right. Uh, rock elementals, as cool as they are, man, are they a pain in my butt. All right, okay, so there's our Jamboa over there. And then we'll go ahead and knock this one out preemptively. And just kind of, uh, give him a few seeds, let him tame up. And we'll get these two home. And uh, what will that give us then? That's five Jerboas we'll have tamed. But only two females. I want at least a third female before we're done here. All right, we are just flying back to base now. We just took our Wyvern out to get a bunch of cactus sap. We have 1,649 of it. The reason is we're gonna combine it with some sand to make some clay. The reason we're gonna make some clay is to make some adobe. So we can make a little house for our many, many Jerboas. Um, so let's take a look. You can just kind of see right there. All right, guys, we are back at base and uh, all the Jerboas are on top of the roof and I figure we need to build them a little bit of a house. So I've got some stuff already made and we're gonna make a bit more. I'm not 100% sure what I need. Let's make maybe one, two, three, four, five of these. One, two, three, four, five of these. Maybe a couple pillars. And uh, that'll probably cover us. I think we might already, oh, we need a, uh, Maybe a couple of these. What are we short on? Clay. Ugh, clay. We have a little bit more clay in here, don't we? Okay, let's do adobe. Sl no. Sl uh, sloped adobe. All right, so what do we got as far as sloped adobe is concerned? We got two lefts, we got two rights. Well, one. Two rights, and then let's make some... One single sloped roof. Perfect. I say that with all, all sarcasm. Uh, okay, this clay's being made. This clay's being made. All right. Try that again. Sloped doob. There we go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Whatever. Good enough. That's what I call good enough. So here's what I think we're going to do. Let's make a little house of sorts. Um, let's grab all our pieces now. We can throw in here all the extra stuff we don't need. Let's just transfer all. And then do Adobe. And then take all. Beautiful. Okay, we don't need any of this stuff on us. All right, recording program cut out there for a little bit. But we got our little house back. So I'm thinking, uh, let's do one of these. One of these. Uh, we're back and now we're building up a little house. I'm thinking maybe on the side railings? No, let's do some of these first. And that way we can do some of this. Yeah, just a little house. That's all. It doesn't need to be a big house. Just a little one. It's just a little guy. Uh, where's our railings? 
Yeah, 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 I'm liking this. One, two, three, four. And then we'll do some sloped roofs right here. So it's not really going to be a house, I think, so much as a little, a little shelter. Now, will it be awesome and let us put one right here? It will not. It will not be awesome and let us put one right here. Hmm. What to do, what to do. Uh, 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 uh. What if I did that? Is that really stupid? Probably? Yeah, that looks obviously ridiculous. Why would I even think that would be a good idea? Okay, let's demolish. So I've solved this problem in the past. Let's see if I can do it again. Uh, where did I leave my bird? My bird, my bird. Is he up top still? Did I just jump, jump down? Seriously, where's my bird? There he is. Okay, so let's go ahead and get on top here. Oop. Take two. Oop. On top. Okay. Nope, this is not going to work, is it? Let's try it just like this. Okay, so if I do this, and then I do this, and I do this, and then I do... It's obstructed, obviously, because I'm on it. This, then theoretically... Uh, I should be able to destroy this one. This one. Uh, uh, we got it. You are not helping. Do you know that? No, not the slope ceiling. All right, let's do this. <laughs> oh, the guy's so fast. <laughs> and will this make everything collapse? Uh, nope, we're good. Awesome, we solved it. We beat the arc. We the won the game. Okay, now I'm stuck in a dragon. Stuck in a dragon. Or a wyvern. Sorry, a wyvern. I know dragons have four legs. Wyverns have two. Oh, right, so the little house pen cage thing is finished, and we get... So I don't know if you know this about Jerboas, but Jerboas all have very unique personalities, and so I gave them all very unique names. We got Connor, Tanner, Mark, Chad, and Cody, our guys. And our gals out here are Claire, Abigail, Amy, and Sarah. Um, oh, and of course, our favorite one, you know, uh, Clargax the Destroyer. Can't forget that guy. So the reason I have the girls out here still... Is uh, let's go highest, lowest. No, oh, no, we skipped it. High, highest, low, low, right here. Is because Clargax has got some work to do. We want to get some little Jerboa babies. I know what you're thinking, which is, don't you have enough Jerboas? And if that is actually what you believe, then I think you need to reevaluate your priorities because I don't think there's such thing as enough Jerboas when you could have more Jerboas. There's such they don't even take up a lot of space, you know what I mean. Stick them all on highest here. Let's see. Huh? That's that's uh, lowest. That's medium. Oh, oh, we're changing the wrong person. Hi. Okay. We want to change Clargax. How's that? What do you got? Clargax highest. Okay. Now I'm gonna go follow me. Enable wandering. Follow me. Enable wandering. This is the first breeding we're doing on Scorched Earth, which is super exciting. Wait, did I hit follow on you? I did. Follow. Enable wandering. Follow. And enable wandering. So, now we're gonna go ahead and keep an eye over here on uh, Sarah. And just start spamming the U's. Why is, why are they not mating? Why, why is this happening to me? Did we not enable wandering on Clargax? It says currently mating. Oh, is it too far away from Sarah? Oh, Sarah. Dang it. Okay. We're gonna have to get Sarah Sarah afterwards. Sarah and, uh... Are we close enough? Okay, Sarah and Claire will be round two. All right, so in just a minute, we should see our first baby Jerboas ever. And I bet you they're going to be just the most adorable thing of all time because they're little tiny little baby Jerboas. All right, let's see. What do we got? Oh, oh no, I thought I thought it was something. Here we go. This is it. This is the time. Oh, what's this? Oh, get that. Gets in the way. Okay. 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 Ah! Oh, my gosh. Okay. Let's get him. Let's get him. Let's get him. Give him some berries. And disable wandering. You too. Come here. Got him. 
and disable wandering and give him some berries all right all right so we got two there and how long till you let's take a look at these suckers come here oh my lord lordy 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 look at that what in the oh look over here look over here again J come here oh <laughs> oh that is that is straight up amazing that's that's absolutely awesome do you need some more berries bud there you go here's some more berries oh <laughs> and you too you yeah baby jerboa needs some berries Cool. So we're gonna let them raise up, and we're gonna hash a couple, hatch, birth a couple more in a minute. All right, guys. I do think that's gonna be it for today. Uh, we did give Korgax the uh, a nice little cool little helmet. If you saw, oh, he looks so awesome. And now we have four little baby jaboas, and they're just growing up, making sure they're keeping fed and all that. Um, and they'll they'll grow up, and we'll have those guys as backups as well. Maybe we'll do some more breeding later. Maybe not. But I think for today, that is gonna be it. I really do appreciate you guys coming to hang out with me. If you did enjoy the video, do me a favor and hit that thumbs up button. And of course, if you haven't already, please feel free to subscribe. You can also hit me up on uh, the Twitters, the Instagrams, your Google Pluses, your Facebooks, and all the whole deals. Uh, all the links are in the description and on my YouTube banner. Um, or you can just look up Ob.x. Not that hard to find. It's pretty simple. And uh, also, I've started a Patreon, so if you feel the urge to be super overly generous, uh, you can find me at patreon.com slash Obadiahx. Um, anyways, guys, as always, I really do appreciate you coming to hang out with me, and I will see you again next time.